came in the box. Yeah. This was in the 70s. Summoned it, didn't know how to get rid of it. It was wreaking havoc in the guy's life. Captured it, his step away from the box. You can't swim? You found a drizzle. Can't sleep in Ohio. Can't eat in Ohio. Can't even go to school in Ohio. What is going on in Ohio? There's been thousands of videos of the most ridiculous things happening, with the only comment being only in Ohio. I haven't seen anything explaining this, so I guess the only way to figure out why this is happening in Ohio is to go there myself. Where? Oh, what the fuck? They would get hurt. Oh, he's running. Oh, shit. Go! Only in Ohio. After a five hour flight, I'm here in Ohio. I'm not trying to only figure out why Ohio is weird for myself. I'm trying to prove it. While I'm here, I'm gonna be taking as here many there. photos of any weird stuff I possibly can. With an iPhone? No, the government could delete the photos off my phone. I need something physical. That's where the Polaroid camera comes in. That takes physical pictures like this. The first place we're headed to to capture pictures, I actually saw directly from a video. We're at our first weird place. A cornfield? field of corn statues. How should I take that? As racism? Cause like, when you have a field of corn, what that mean? Hmm? Like, if you put my high yo, tell me what that mean, please. Cause, uh, I think it's racism. I ain't gonna lie to you. Like, why would anyone even come here? I'm like six foot. A field of corn. It was weird for sure, but it definitely Racist. wasn't proving why all the other weird stuff was happening here. Since we didn't really know where to go next, we gotta ask some people. Excuse me, have you seen anything weird in Ohio? Sure have. Everywhere? Everywhere? Everywhere. I'm on a freeway. I know you know. That, like a group of cars slow down. That means Interesting. I'm different. I'm not a follower. I'm my own leader. Like there we've you heard go. aliens there are you here, go, my boy. Oh, and ghosts. Not a whole lot of that's really exist. Ghosts, though, Maybe that's why. are prevalent. Marysville actually Marysville. Uh, Marysville at night a lot of people say that you can hear like screams and stuff So we headed to Marysville and the first weird place we saw there was a uh, abandoned church mm -mm. It's Ohio. This is such a white people thing White people do this stuff not black people. I'm sorry. We don't do this you broke out died. You don't want to get in there and like fall through Dude, this is the coolest place. After exploring that and finding some more evidence, we stumbled across possibly one of the weirdest places in Marysville. This had to be what the lady was talking about. An actual abandoned mansion. We're about to go into this Why? place. Apparently in like the early 1900s, there was a slave house. Family killed there slave and people house. say that the ghosts apparently this had to be what and look, finding look, some look, more look, evidence. Look, look. We stumbled across That's possibly one house. of the weirdest places Damn, in Marysville. Nah, this had I mean? to be what the lady was talking about. An actual abandoned mansion. We're about to go into this place, apparently in like the early mm -hmm. night. See, that's massive house. Massive. You know what I mean? Like, that's crazy. It's like, I don't think Ohio is haunted. It's just a slave town, bro. Like, it's, it's yeah, it's a slave town. 1900s, there was a family killed there, and people say no, that the ghosts haunt the there. mansion. It's definitely a little bit scary, but I literally need to find out why Ohio is like this. That's the sole reason I came to Ohio. We got there, and it was massive, and right across from it was a fully operational, extremely large prison. So we were trying to quietly find a way in, and we really just couldn't. But after about 30 minutes of searching, oh, this is our entrance. A flashlight mm -mm. right here. Apparently ghosts can communicate through flashlights and since a lot of ghosts were here I had the brilliant idea to put my flashlight in the middle of the haunted mansion Okay, let's ask the flashlight questions Oh, what the f If there's a spirit in here, turn off mm. If people die here, turn off turn Is off. Ohio a crazy state? This is your last chance, flashlight Bro, don't forget, it turned on that first time though <laughs> We're getting some real proof. We're not. I'm not gonna lie, guys. Um, we haven't captured anything weird. I mean, we're yeah. starting to get somewhere though. There's I ain't a lot seen of nothing. supernatural stuff I'm going on in Ohio. But there was one big Angle issue. Out to we you. were not the smartest with communicating with these spirits. But luckily, there was someone that could help us. Because one of the only witch museums in America was in Ohio, and we were headed there now. We literally just drove two hours to like a, a witchcraft and magic museum. I'm hoping there's some interesting stuff there. I don't have any proof of Ohio being that weird except for some corn. What's I'm that? hoping we get something here. Welcome to the I don't see nothing. I don't know. 
Besides this, you feel me? Because witchcraft. After seeing a ton of weird stuff, we ended up finally getting some information on how to talk to these Ohio spirits. The only thing a pendulum really needs to be, for example, is it just has to be a, a heavy enough object that can swing freely. Like asking questions of the pendulum, like, are the ghosts here and stuff like that. The wow. biggest mistake that people make when doing stuff like this, where they I'll go wrong, goodbye. is that they don't end the session formally and you don't hear anything, so you just turn it off and put it in your pocket. Yeah, y'all, y'all gone. Don't do that. Before you do that, you say, okay, thank you. Goodbye for now. And just as we thought we got everything we needed, she showed us one last thing. Camera's off for this part. Demon in the box. Yeah. This was in the 70s. Summoned it, didn't know how to get rid of it. It was wreaking havoc in the guy's life. Captured it, his step away from the box. Leave it alone. Leave the box closed. Whatever you do. Don't open the box. This was the weirdest oh, thing wow. we had seen so far. This could be the reason why all the weird stuff is happening in Ohio. Is that okay if I take yeah, pictures so fake. of some stuff? No flash. Flash cool. annoys the demon awesome. in the box. I was taking pictures of stuff. Everything was going good 20? until I accidentally took Bruh. a picture of the box with the flash. Bro. You a minute. Anything happened? Anything happened? this thing up and then you're hours gone. Hey. She was telling us to apologize to the demon. Oh, oh, she's whoa, whoa, whoa. They black guys. They black guys. She's they, black. They, they black guys. They black guys. Uh, my God. But like, they not be really black. They like probably mixed whatever. Because of us, we just pissed off a ghost. Hell yeah. <laughs> Look, look at him. Things were getting weird. I was glad we were able to get some evidence, but I was really we don't hopeful do this. we didn't piss off that demon. They pay him good. But anyways, before we left there, she had given yeah. us two last places to check out. The last location was apparently the most haunted place in Ohio. But before that, we went to the gates of hell. Wow. We going in there? Yeah, a long, long time ago. Like a dude went in there and never came out. No high swag like a high. We were capturing some decent stuff at this location, but nothing really weird was happening until yeah. we started leaving. <laughs> Oh, wow. This random lady started actually chasing us out of the woods. Film with me. Here's my phone. Here's my phone. Where is she? Are you guys good? You good? Mm -mm. Bro, there's like 20 dudes. She here. wired up. What do you mean? Let's go film with. Wait, there's what? Bro, they're walking towards the car. Oh, oh he's running. Why don't you show it? Just show oh, it. Shit. Karate, what the? What the? What the Yo, fuck? what the? Bro, she came out of there like a. God, zombie, bro. Bro, and she was not speaking English. What the? With things starting to get extremely weird, we headed to the last place to get the final evidence. All right, oh, no. we just got to the place that the witch suggested to us. Which I do know another place. Hunderson, other people didn't believe in it. Stuff would happen to them all the time, like they would get hurt. So we got this from the Magic Witch Shop. Bro, if we get a picture of this, like, upside down, Ohio is proven weird. It's like when we first got here, it didn't seem like it was that weird, and then at the end, it just slowly got weirder and weirder. We're going deep. <laughs> I'm sorry, bro. I'm sorry. He sounds so white, yo. I ain't gonna lie to you, yo. It's so crazy, you know, like, we got in here. Nah, come on, bro. You, you, Come on, dude. Nah, man. Put some flavor in your voice, dog. Come on. To the forest, and this this was the chance to figure out why Ohio was like this, why all this weird stuff was happening. Fake. This was the chance to get our final evidence. I'm religious, so I believe in God and everything, but I'm trying to, I guess, talk to a spirit. Hopefully, Jesus got me. So, wait, explain how it works. Do you know how it works? Does someone want to ask a question? Bro, it is actually like feels like it's moving weird. I'm not even. She said, start off by saying hello to a spirit. Hello, how are you, spirits? I hope you're having a nice day. Am I tripping? Nope. <laughs> is Ohio a weird place? Then finally, I got the last piece of evidence. Can we take move if if we can take a Polaroid of this? Hmm. Dude, that thing is moving. Oh, we can. Perfect. I guess. After looking at all of the evidence, all of the proof that we captured the entire Ohio trip, all this weird stuff has, has been happening because it's, it's cursed, obviously. There's literally a demon in Ohio. I don't think so. No wonder weird stuff is going on. 
All right, I don't think so. I think it's more so like it's a slave town. Cut the corn, the master house, you know what I mean? I, I get like slavery vibes from that. I know I ain't trying to be like racist or trying to be like, oh my God, push a black narrative, but that's what I got from it. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. You tell me what y'all think in the comments, all right? Do this. <laughs>